Welcome back guys on gaming with you again. Time for some more black guards. So our next Ready. fight as a gladiator is I think all of us versus some beast. So here's here's another. Anything nothing. else you can teach us? Oh wait, I don't need to train. Though uh, maybe though. Maybe he needs to train. He doesn't need armor use. The spells are good. Um, base values, though, is the thing to consider with him. Could use some constitution, possibly. Because we only need five... Nope, 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 save it, save it. Um, I have a feeling that we will be here a while. Let's go to Norum. And talents. I do want to get his Warcraft up. Uh, what's it do whenever it gets high enough? Let me swap without losing an action this turn. If they... Uh, also, if they attack special and two additional special moves. Okay. No. Nothing really to get on him. Main character has good perception. Oh, though we could go... He has treat wounds. be not too bad to get his treat wounds up so he can heal himself. Worst case scenario. Or some hit points. Yep. I'm gonna try to get treat wounds up to uh, tier two. We're ready. ready. Good luck. Good luck. So some oh this should be not too bad. Norm goes first. Let's wait. Uh, Archer chick, just step back. And... Yeah, let's just start railing on one of these dudes. Holy cow. Nice freaking hit. Wow. Wait. Okay, step back. Go ahead and throw some fire at these things. I mean, they're wolves. They should be flammable. Thirteen, not too bad. Let me guess. There's gonna be another fight after this, like immediately. All right, they're all up on Norum. Uh, yeah, let's go for the injured one here. It's not terribly injured, but it is injured. Sixer. Um. Let's get up here and try to finish it off. Not quite. Norum. Kind of like hitting this one. I don't mind the one that has two wounds. I mean, he's got two wounds. He's pretty ineffectual. And I will go ahead and shoot the one hit point one. There we go. Head it to the ground. Double hit the double wounder. Let's go ahead and bash him. You too. Hit it with your club. There we go. Easy fight. This is so much easier than the last battle. You guys are gonna attack Norm? That's your mistake. You only get one for battle too. That's it. That's your mistake. Did she shoot it? Looks like it. Looks like your aim shot just does more damage. Doesn't look like you suffer any penalties for doing it compared to power blow, which has a lower hit chance. Bam. Easy peasy, Wolvies. I should have power blowed. I don't know what I was thinking. Shoot him. Stab him. Club his tail. There. He goes for Norm of all things. I'll take it. Oh, we missed. It's okay. We should kill him this round. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Got him. Yay. Easy fight. Five Ducats. We'll take it. 
All right, let's talk the to you game again. has changed a bit. Diego Monterey will explain. What? Once a year, the exalted Kyrios Marwan Al Ahmad sponsors the Battle of the Nine Hordes in the arena of Mengpila. Oh, okay. No gladiator has ever survived these fights. What? Therefore, the gladiator school refuses to let us use any of their fighters in the show. So, we need new gladiators, and we think you might be suitable. Any questions? Yeah. WTF. What exactly are these nine hordes? The greatest spectacle in the history of Mengbila. Marwan went all out. He collected the deadliest beasts the arena has ever seen. The gladiators are supposed to defend a captive maiden against the hordes, which is virtually impossible. Marwan oh. wants this forest man, Diamantos. The Kyrios will receive the gladiators who prove themselves. If Takati wins, he can have him. Then I hope for all of us that he huh. doesn't lose. Maiden. Who's this maiden? A pretty girl named Aurelia. Oh, of course. But she's also a nasty witch. She committed some sort of crime. Not sure which one. The city guard was after her, but we were faster. Anything else? Let's just click this real quick. Just looking at our AP. He should be able to rank up treat wounds again. Which, uh, confirm. The girl. Uh, she's got dagger training. I didn't realize that. Let's go full defense foam dagger. She's actually pretty good with spears. I didn't realize she was that good with them. Firm main character, 600 ability points. Still need to get weapon up. Oh, it is at 14, isn't it? Interesting. Yeah, I guess we just save because we are going to need a bunch of different skills. Uh, and I'd like to just be able to buy him, like, Master Archer. Save. Good luck. We should know. What? I need to know if the maiden in the arena really is Aurelia. She might know. What. Let's take care of our. Yeah, let's take care of our. Raja first. Bathe. Pick uh, what you want. Hunting bolts. We should be kind of getting low on arrows on our main girl, though. 19. Um. Worst case scenario, she will have a spear. Armor set. Done. Inventory. Some leather pants we could sell. That nah, doesn't matter. I have a feeling we're going to escape or something. I'm gonna take a couple of these arrows out and give them to the girl. So let's just give like. her 27 okay let's make sure we're on the right weapon sets she's on bow I want him to start an archer set shield shield good close and um what anything new to say nope see you in the oh, let's quick save uh, I don't know what's happening next you turned out to be a decent team. Mm. Let's see whether you can take on Takati. Ready? Uh, ready. We're ready. Good luck. Is it us versus Takate? I mean, four on one, I... No, it's not. Oh, no. Throw an axe. Is this one Takate? This one's Takate. I just threw the axe at us. I have a feeling we're gonna get freaking rocked. It looks like they have a spellcaster. We're gonna go for the spellcaster first thing. Twelver. That's a pretty good start. Um, come stand behind the dwarf girl. Shoot the spellcaster. If I can get rid of the spellcaster first round, I'm pretty happy. 
Can you fireball her? Oh no, it's um, the door. Can I possibly knock this dude down? Nope. Well, it's three damage though. Ugh, she's got a good fireball. Are you kidding me? I still can't fireball her? Hold on. I need to do this, though. Put those up there. Uh, fastness body one, two, healing one. We use those a lot. Alright, well. If I can't fireball her, let's go for the one with the shield. This guy's got a lot of hit points. I have a very strong feeling we're going to fail. No! Oof, missed. Is he body blocking for the archer? Or for the mage? I swear he's intentionally body blocking me. Boom! Got her though. Kate, if you're gonna stand back there, I'm gonna rail on your other dudes. Try to knock me down, you idiot. I'll show you how to knock someone down. Maybe. Let's go for this one. Oh, wait. Can I still hit her? Burn the one with the shield. Almost down. So he's running up. I have a feeling Takate is going to be the hardest one to kill. Maybe we can get lucky with a wound. Nope. Archer girl. That, that actually hit Takate pretty hard, so let's go for him again. Yeah, he's not as strong as he looks. She's pretty low, so. Let's see if we can possibly... No. Nope. Ouch. My mage is going to get squished here in just a second. Nice. Oh, ho, ho! Blocked! Owned! Finisher? Yes! Nice! Suck this, Takate. Die! Oh, no, not quite. <laughs> Tried to knock him down. Alright, so... Uh, no, no, no. I want to move him here, and if I can heal the dwarf, that would be great. This forces Takate to at least move if he wants to stab me. Bash Takate. Or shoot him. He's just getting reamed. Okay, this fight is not nearly as hard as I was expecting. Is that two? Health potion away, buddy. How many slots does your belt have is what I want to know. You just keep trying to knock to my door. It's not going to happen. Seven mana. Not enough to do anything. Let's just armor up our dwarf. We have it up. Eh, level one's fine. Alright. Takate, nice healing potion. You're just delaying the inevitable. He's gonna healing potion again, I bet. So that's the fourth item he's used in this fight. He's nearly at full hit points, but he's got to be out of items. Who's next? If we could just hit, that would be a start. Right. Let's just move around. Kata, you can keep health pushing all you want, but these arrows are really adding up on you. 
Nice hit. Alright, we're good. I don't even need to power attack you, buddy. Just regular attack you, because you're going down, down. Joink. Suck it. <gasps> Even if you drop my dwarf, I will kill you before you get to do anything. <sighs> but, uh, luckily for us, we get to heal the dwarf. Still, no one suffered any wounds. Amazing. Yoink. Suck it. One. Dang it. Uh, just shoot him. Oh. Enough. Break off the fight. No. You've all proven yourselves worthy of facing the Nine Hordes. No. I am defeated. Give me the final blow. You'll get to die soon enough, Gladiator. Marwan wants to see you fight in Mengbila. You'll accompany the others. Now get some rest. Your journey towards glory or death begins tomorrow. Welcome to our traveling circus, forest man. <laughs> Suck it, forest man. I only get 50 AP for that. I should get totally more. I don't understand why I'm getting gold. I'm a slave. Welcome to Mengbila, gladiators. No arena is more beautiful. And only the Bal Honak arena is larger. This is Tulifa Alkira, the most glorious gladiator in Mengbila She's and old. director of the gladiator school. She'll answer your questions. Why is it questions. always a woman? All right, you amateurs. The fight against the Nine Hordes will soon begin. A three-day massacre. If I were you, I'd confess all my sins tonight. Is there a prize? Of course. The winners get to spend a night with the maiden. Oh! Provided the maiden survives as well, of course. It's not much of a prize, to be honest. What's Wait, awaiting us now? Nine battles in three days. Really? Nine? The most bloodthirsty Holy audience crap. in the South, and opponents who know no mercy. Do I have to fight too? Nobody can force you to, sweetheart. But I recommend that you at least parry your enemy's blows. Uh, maiden? The maiden. What do you know about her? Aurelia is a beautiful girl. Too bad the crowd won't really notice. She wears a mask of shame. Of course. Why does the damsel have to wear a mask? They say she's a witch. The mask prevents her from casting spells. Ah, or perhaps Marwan just wants to heighten the drama. We'd like to learn something. All right, what do you teach? Do wielding a dodge, attacks, attacks of opportunity. There we go, my friends. Ah, marksman. Nice. What's this? Battle intuition. Uh, receives an initiative bonus and also able to dodge attacks more. So I need to get his intuition way up. Wow. So she definitely teaches a lot more. Ooh. Hero is attuned and doing more damage. Wow. So I need to get his weapon up. This chick teaches all kinds of good stuff. Tax opportunity. Uh, attempt to move past her, which is perfect because I throw him way out in the front. So we've been waiting on that one. So we need to get 200 AP for dodge, which we're going to need. Nice. Zoroban can still get nothing. Vigilance. Uh, suffer penalty. Tax He does need dodge. Firm. This is still 500. We have plenty for it. Let's look at spells. Um, we got fastness of body to level two. We need more uh, astral points on this dude. Intuition would give us astral points. Gonna need agility for that. Charisma. I would like to get Astral Region 2 at some point as well, so we will need the Charisma point. 
It's 410. I have a feeling I'm not going to learn any spell stuff for him for a long time, considering the uh, situation we're in. So that's not too bad to pick up a charisma point here. Alright. Yeah, that seems fine. We'll save it like that for now on him. Oh, we do have Monkey Man, or Forest Man. Alright. Uh, let's continue with our main characters first. Special abilities. So we can get attacks of opportunity. We don't need that as much as we need Marksman. Uh, ignores enemy's armor and may cause a wound. That seems really powerful. And we have dodge 2. It's pretty cheap. So I'm guessing she's not going to teach us triple shot or uh, that. So yeah, let's get dodge 2. So when you have initiative 10, situation see if it's initiative bonus. So it just helps you go first. Dodge three. So yeah, I'll just get dodge. We have 192 ability points, which means we can level up bow. Because we need to get it to 16. Yes, confirm base values. Can I I'll go ahead and raise my resistance to magic. It's perfect. I actually kind of think everyone needs to get a couple points and resist to magic. Yeah, Norm, 10. That's pretty good. Uh, including you, 2 points, that's a good start. Confirm. For you, girl, you can almost learn uh, this. So we'll save, we'll pick that up the next fight. She'll need to get Vigilance at some point as well. So we save for that. So this guy, what does he do? He's got very good Perception, very good Warcraft, Body Control, Willpower. We definitely are going to pump to 8. Um, weapon Talents. Yes, yeah, save these changes. What does he use? He's a Spear guy. He's got a 14 in Spears already. That's pretty nice. Spear is two-handed. Can't use a shield. Specials. He does not have attack for opportunity, so we will want that. Melee Master. Cost 400 AP. We could definitely get him to Melee Master. I think we will. So, one, two. He can keep going past 16. Alright. How? F 18 is the max. Okay. So, 16. Confirm. You need three. Oh. Oh well. That 16 is definitely needed. Attack opportunity. Confirm. Uh, power blow. He does not know. Stab, maces, sword, sabers. So you cannot do power blow with, um, with spears. It's one of the few you cannot do it with. Shield fighting, you can't use shield with uh, spears. Let's just go to base attributes. His strength is pretty low. So, two points in strength. And two points in hit points. 43 health. He's got a lot in courage. I wonder why that is. He doesn't have spells, does he? No, he's not a caster. Close. Here's some equipment, and then go to the door. Get some equipment. Alright, well let's see what equipment we have to begin with. All of our stuff is back. Holy cow. Oh man, I'm so happy. Takate, screw you. Let's get to my guys. Main character. All my stuff is back. Uh -huh. Where's my longbow? Thank you. And my arrows. 21. We'll be able to buy some more, so confirm. Big arrows. Oh, we got a bunch of arrows, actually. Let's just get this up to a solid 50. Firm. Alright, my armor. Let's put on my, um... Let's just put on my leather set to begin with. Um... 
my leather helmet, please? Kinda sucks that I have to do all this re-equipping, but hopefully you guys don't mind too much. Oh, it's nice to get all my gear back. Holy cow. Look how much money we have, too. Nice. So nice. Oh, we're gonna be pimped out. Um, don't want those gloves. Or, I can wear those gloves. Actually, let's wear the, um... Let's see, which gloves to wear? Gladiator gloves, 60%. These are better. So, um, the gladiator set's gonna be on the main dwarf, so... Yeah, that's what we can wear. We just need our rapier. So, yeah, this would lower our attack. Right. No, it's just straight more damage. That's all it is. Boom. Dwarf. Armor. So you can wear this helmet because I have uh, other crap that you're going to wear. You're going to wear your dwarf set, yeah. Switching over the Babrik set would give him... Infantry probably is like... Uh, encumbrance to... What's my current encumbrance? Pretty good. He does need armor use too, I guess. So someone else could wear my Babrik set. Maybe this guy? He's actually got a full set of that, but what would this give you? Oh, he's got super belt on. War belt. Um, let's give you the chainmail coif. And where are the correct pants? Why is this stuff not sorted? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Dwarf. Dwarf, dwarf, dwarf. You have no boots on. You can wear your sweet boots. Nice. And this guy, Takate. So if you wore that, you have 70, 50, 20, 10. How's Norms look? Okay, the bashing damage seems pretty re relevant, though. So maybe we do go with the Gladiator stuff for now. Um, yeah, having the full gladiator set on is pretty nice. The fabric set... Yeah, I need the bashing resist, so yeah, this is worth. Let's put small belts on all my guys. And let's equip her up. She was wearing the leather coat before. She's got leather pants on. She was wearing a tricorn. And... She could wear gladiator stuff though, couldn't she? I almost have a full set. Oh, she's a mage though, she can't wear metallic. She cannot wear metallic. He can wear his gambeson boots, his gambeson shirt. Uh, the leather pants are fine, I guess. His tricorn. Gambeson gloves. Yep, that seems fine. The girl can wear leather boots. And I have no gloves for her. Weapons. Norum. You would be happy to have your axe back. My axe. I think this shield is pretty good on you, though. Uh, 16, 14, 7. There's a lot more parry. Yeah, let's go with this shield, though. Yep. I actually think that shield wouldn't be too bad on my main guy, though. Where'd it go? I like that shield. Where'd it 
we go. Where is... Oh, it's right there. Yeah, there we go. Alright, alright. And also your bone and shield set. This guy's got crappy staff. Let's give him his masqueron staff. And does he have any other talents? Let's look at him real quick. Talents. Weapons. Um, no melee weapons, just staves. Staves. Let's go full defense on you. Good, 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 good. Equip. You're pretty well set, my friend. Girl can use more arrows. Her bunch of arrows, confirm. And she's actually okay with daggers. I could give her a dagger and a buckler as a secondary weapon. No, she's okay with... Yeah, you can't wear um, spear and shield. Okay. Armor. Okay. We'll worry about potions after we saw some stuff. Merchant. Sinew cutter bolts. Blah, blah, blah. Let's just sell our leftover crap. Like, we have a lot of leather pants. A lot of leather pants. Shabby belt, shabby belt. Shabby belt, shabby belt. How many of these can I sell? Confirm. Yet another pair of leather pants. Weapons, we don't need a club. Short bow, quarter thing. Uh, buckler is better than metal shield. Epi. I'm going to keep that long dagger, I still like it. Extra long bow, club. Is there a spear on, um, Takate? He has a Dajra. 5 through 10. 1d6 plus 4, plus 1, minus 1, plus 2. It's the same thing, right? 1d6 plus 4. Looks like it's the exact same thing to me. I'm gonna go ahead and sell it. Armors, items. I think we're pretty good on selling stuff. Is there anything we need to buy? Blunt arrows. Vex knockdown. They're pretty cheap. Cleaver. Rinse. Less damage, piercing versus this is piercing. Okay, mace don't need, core staff don't need. Some more of these. Metal buckler, Psy. Psy does infantry damage. Great sword, great slave sword. Uh, ooh, longbow maybe. I didn't see one. Yeah, short bow. They do have lots of arrows, so it's good to see. Oh, they have lots of armor. So this guy's wearing the full gladiator set. He does need some boots. Bosparian sandals. Whoa. Bronze cross. Wait, are these the gloves that I have on my main guy? They are. Oh, nice, nice, nice. We can... We can outfit him with the full bronze set. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling that, man. Alright, so we just need to get the... Um, You know, the gauntlets off our main guy. Sorry this is just an inventory episode, guys, but, um, yeah, I didn't know that's what it was going to be. So let's take these gloves off, and we can just put on random gloves, doesn't matter. The gladiator gloves. We can actually...
probably equip a full gladiator set to him. Would that be better? That would. It would be better. Bam, he's got the full gladiator. He's got the full uh, set on now. That's nice. Two armor rating. Nice. So yeah, we're going to put the gladiator set on our main guy since he's... only thing he's missing right now is the uh, leggings. We can move the leather. Yeah, let's just go ahead and throw these on him. We can move the full leather set onto our archer. Because she can wear that. We'll take her tricorn away. And she needs hardened leather boots. And a leather shirt. Did I not just... Yeah, there we go. Sweet. So she's got a full leather set on. Let's go back to the vendor. So that means we can sell leather coat. Tricorn boots. I don't think I need... Fiber coat chosses. Why is this worth so little? I think that's a bug. Alright, so I needed the leggings on the main character? No. Main character. Yeah, he needs leggings. Confirm. And he's going to need a hat of some sort. That one's pretty good. Doesn't have infantry damage protection. Could have went with the chainmail set too. Chainmail is probably better than this gladiator crap. I'll just get this hat. We look like a goofball. What's he wearing? Gladiator set? They don't have the full chain set here though, do they? Chainmail coif. Gauntlets, boots. Yeah, they don't have the full set. He's not wearing boots. Oh no. I have to buy back my leather boots that I just sold. Alright, that's fine. Everyone else in our party is fully geared, right? She doesn't have gloves. She can't wear metal gloves, so she has to just deal with it. They do have chainmail gloves. So they have mail coif, gloves. I'm missing it. They don't. Yeah, they're missing the uh, the boots and the leggings. So yeah, chainmail would be useless. Items. Potions, traps, thorn mat. Interesting. Antidote, bandage, curse. Interesting. Good healing potion, javelins, throwing axes. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Looks like we're ready. Um, I'm actually going to pick up some of these blunt bolts. Let's get all of them. That way she has a secondary kind of bolt, too. Now let's just sell our leftover crap. I don't think we need... Let's sell those. I don't think I need the gladiator armor. Weapons. We're good. Alright, one last thing to do, and then we'll do at least one battle. This guy dual wield. Special abilities. He doesn't even know how to dual wield. Why is he wearing double axes? He has no points in axe. He has eight into thrown weapons, and he's got a lot in spear. Why in the world is he double cleavering? Thrown axe does a lot of damage. Holy cow, 1d6 plus 8? Okay. So he's got master healing... 500, what? 
Why is there a weak healing potion here in the middle? Oh no. 500 healing. Wow. Wow, he can heal for 500? What? Alright, um... Items... Give you a healing potion... And poison, switch you to the right weapons. It's the wrong poison, though. Arachne. Norum. Well, last ditch effort, you can have um, master healing. I have five of these? That's oh, a weak healing potion. Where'd that crazy super healing potion go? There you go. You have a master healing potion, worst case scenario. This guy needs his astral potions. There we go. Nyam. Weak healing potion. She has some thrown weapon skills, so we will give her a javelin. Seems good. Alright. Let's quick save and then prepare to lose a fight. Sound good to you guys? Sounds good to me. Talk to you. Nine hordes. Will you also fight? I'm not an idiot. <laughs> what? At least. So yeah, um, we're gonna die to the nine. What is it? Do you have Naya? They say Mangbilly. If you have, <laughs> you'll have beans. If you're. Really? Where did you? F the guard of the black cohort was after her in the alchemist, alchemist but not quarters? the charitable Marwan was extremely eager. He probably saved her from a cruel. F okay. What's what is crime? the maid? Rumor has it she tried to assassinate an honorable member of, of or something like. Who is this? The exalted Marwan ibn Khadims, Kyrios of Mengbila, and honorable member. You're certain his slaves are the best and noblest in the Noble south. Take a slaves, look. Right? There's a slave. The Brotherhood of Slave Masters. Slave master One of the nine. Glug Ankbesi, their leader, is also the Grand Emir of this city. Maybe someday Marwan will take a if you live there. So Marwan is sponsoring the. Of course not. Because he's generous and respectful. Okay, so Attention! Still alive, I. Can you teach us some? She can train us. I don't need to train, though. I've already done this. So, sleep. I guess that's what I'm supposed to do. Go to sleep. All right, guys. Here comes a big battle. Sorry about all the uh, setup there. Welcome. If I had known, good I people of Mangbilla. Over the next know, three days, so you will witness the bloodiest fights our proud arena has ever seen. I, the humble Marwan al Ahmad ibn Khadims, give you the battle oh, of the cool. nine hordes. Will our five heroes be able to free the maiden Aurelia from the claws of evil? Salute those who are about to die. Let the games begin! You're the gladiators. Please give your best. I don't want to die. Aurelia. What? You! You? What? Behold! The first horde, Mengbila. We'll start easily enough. But beware. Even Redfur's dream of fame, blood, and glory. How did you get here? Not now. Alright. What are these? These look like traps. Okay. So they set off traps. Ouch! Crap! Why does he have no hit points? Kate, you had... you just took, like, a boatload of damage. Right? Let's try to... oh, I can't shoot anything from here. This wall is partial by cover. Oh 
my gosh, these traps. I'm gonna die to these traps. Step on a trap. Nope. I'm getting the feeling that every other square is a trap. What in the world? This is so dumb. Oh, really? That goes off when you step on it? I can stab him. Holy crap, this poison. I'm totally gonna... <laughs> We're gonna lose this battle so hard. Come on, could there not be 500 million traps? I'm already dealing with this giant freaking battlefield. And I missed. This fight is stupid. I don't get it. How did he miss? Of all people? Okay. Goblin just dodged him. This is ridiculous. 500 million traps on this stupid map. I better get to rest after this fight. There's no way. There's no way. Two of my people are down already. I've killed like one of them if I'm lucky. Are you kidding me? This is so insane. This is so dumb. How can he even shoot that far? I can't. I can't come close to shooting that far. Mm. Can I shoot you? Nope, I can shoot this one. Next. Oh. <laughs> my hit points up to 
fireball. Let's fireball this guy. Step on a trap. I can't step anywhere without stepping on a trap. Step on a trap. He can cast that far? Holy shnikes! How can he cast that far? I can't cast half that far. It's a freaking goblin. How can he cast further than me? to hide behind the wall until they come to me? Is that it? This is ridiculous. So ridiculous. While I enjoy this game, it is quite dumb how many traps are on this freaking level. Two of my people died immediately to traps. Come on. Of course. After I kill this one, I'm just gonna run behind the wall, and they have to come to me then, right? Of course you hit. Why would you not? Haha, <laughs> oh yeah. Can't walk without stepping on a trap. Can I hit anything from here? Shoot the barrel. F you barrel. I told my guy to move and he did nothing. Shot at me. Fourteen. At one, I will die to poison on my turn. from your poison. Oh, the poison doesn't stop. That's great. 
I have to take this freaking poison damage the whole fight. I'm just gonna die to poison. So dumb. Ugh. Of course. This is the dumbest thing I've ever played. This map makes no sense. I'm gonna die just from poison. AP for it, okay. We'll get you out of here. How did you hold the law? Wait a moment. Are you kidding me? What is this bullcrap? Well, there's no way I'm winning this fight. Are you kidding me? So it looks like there's... Is this supposed to be water on the ground? That's everywhere? One way to find out. There's no way I'm winning this fight. And these guys are gonna shoot all the way across the map. And not oh okay, I've dodged two so far. Look at these wounds I have. This is so dumb. Screw it. this I don't know can I shoot those
can't target those. Okay. Okay, so you can set this liquid on fire. Oh no, if I use a fire attack, it'll probably set it on fire one of them. Well, there's one way to find out. This fight is dumb. B. Uh, let's just get healed. Okay, with my archers, I should be able to do some work here as long as I keep them pushing this over on me. This guy's a bit pretty low. Ow! Bane, Hamper's ability is his ability to move and carry. Of course. Got him. Alright, mage. That guy's not on the water, so maybe. It's not too bad. So good. Or may cause two wounds. Should go for that. Holy cow, that's a good move. Heal up, girl. Zervan. Heal up. Just 
get over to these healing pools and get some healing going. Does it heal wounds? Oh, it does. It heals a wound, too. Alright. Takashi, dude. So this is a fight designed to help you, like, like re-heal all your stuff here. Zerban. You're kind of trapped on this side, aren't you? Alright. So this fight isn't as dumb as I was thinking. It's giving me a chance to heal up and get prepared for the next fight. This one's super easy. And I'm gonna have another fight right after this, as we should be. So these guys wanna come and you know push all these things down and burn. Is that a bad guy? No, it's too much. Dwarf. He's gonna come heal. And then I'm just gonna mow these guys down as they try to kill I need to get all my guys curiosity to I just need to heal all my guys up. She's cool. So get her out of the fire pack. Start mowing down these idiots as they come to me. Boom, suck it. And I need to regen his mana for the next turn. Stay out of the potential burn. Where's the fire pit? on fire now. Yoink. That's not what I wanted to do. That's annoying. That's not what he was supposed to do.
suck it. Tried to run past Zerbin, or Takashi, or whatever his name is. Did not smile. Boom. Let's go for the death blow, man. Stab. Alright, not too bad. So now we're full hit points, and no wounds, and all back up. That first fight was ridiculous, though. So far, our gladiators have hardly been challenged. Let's see what happens when they meet copies of themselves. What? Really? Okay, guys. Well, we're going to end this one here. We will continue on in the next one. Thanks for watching. This has been Blackguards. Gaming out.